planets spin, planets orbit. They move through space for billions of years without slowing down. It feels endless. So why can't we build machines that do the same, true free energy forever? The answer is hidden deep inside the laws of physics. In space, there's almost no friction, no air resistance, no ground pulling back. Once a planet gets moving, it stays moving, thanks to inertia, Newton's first law of motion. Gravity curves space, pulling planets into orbits, but it doesn't stop them. It bends their path like a skateboard on a ramp. In contrast, here on Earth, friction is everywhere. Wheels rub against surfaces, air pushes back. Magnetic fields face resistance. Every machine loses tiny amounts of energy as heat, sound, or drag. Even if we built the perfect device, Earth's gravity and atmosphere would eventually slow it down. In orbit, satellites mimic endless motion because they move fast enough to keep falling around Earth without ever hitting it. Could we ever create an Earth-based orbit machine? A true energy device using magnetic levitation, vacuum chambers, and free-fall principles? Maybe someday. But even then, tiny imperfections, quantum fluctuations, material fatigue, would steal energy over time. In space, energy isn't free. It's preserved by emptiness. Here on Earth, resistance wins. Endless energy exists, but only where nothing fights it. Do you believe humanity will one day cheat resistance and build true endless motion? Or is space the only place where forever can really happen? Tell us below.